Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a fairly a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio do Jogal, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. And so, the national anthems. some performance and now here comes the response does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullbacks, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. the whistle and here we go well that's where he wants it and he just whacks it away out to the right time to deliver lovely bit of skill there it's a good looking cross forward it goes to get it forward quickly uh, it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing Mavropanos Mavropanos drives it forward and it's played forward tries to get it clear well, that's a foul free kick's been given Gets it upfield. Battles to win it back. Chip through. That's been drilled forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Hoists it forward. He's got options out wide. Great leap! Still goalless at the moment. And a foul. Yes, the uh, referee's given it.
14. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. service like that it's so difficult to defend when the ball comes in so swiftly you can't question the finishing in this instance i think though there's enough grounds for them to keep working at it teams it out wide it's a loose ball he's going after it oh that is asking for trouble Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. No question, that's a foul. Defending of the desperate variety. to get it forward quickly and he's there to cut it out the forward pass has he found his man and he's made sure that that won't get through as it pulls forward Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Played in with accuracy. Well, it really is one cross after another. Well, with a target to hit, why not keep up the supply? It's simple and, and efficient because they all know what they're doing. Beautifully done. Plenty waiting in the middle. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. More than happy to take the muscular approach. And the first 45 minutes are up. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still. And the second half gets on the way. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. And it's played forward. Wood. And it's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And that's going to be a booking. Forward it goes. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's got to up the quality and, and set an example. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Gets wrestled off the ball. Could move up a gear here. 
He's through. It's one! It's in! The breakthrough arrives at last! Now looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. Plays it out to the wing. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. This has gone, that's a foul. He's come loose. Really good feet. Wood. New Zealand are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, it's a natural instinct to defend when it has a hit! Oh, that is very close. Ah, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. Reese making consecutive changes here. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. Forward it goes. And he's going long. That is terrific skill. There are a few waiting for it. Pumps it into the area. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Hoists it forward. New Zealand are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Cuts it out. Tries to locate someone up front. Drives it towards the front. He's put it on the right now. What's on? Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Greece just have to run down the clock. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's on a plate. Wood! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Wood really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1 0. Yeah, it was never a match that was going to blow us all away, Peter, but I felt the team did a lot right, especially that well timed goal.
That's it for tonight's match. It just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me.